Oh man, so both Cardano and Coty are failing to continue their patterns in their wedges. They're both breaking out to the downside. And I'm going to share you, with you my exact price target to be wary of on the downside. We're also going to take a look at Algorand because Algorand is looking nice and strong and is doing something in the charts, which means we could be excited for this to bounce and head higher. So thanks for joining the video, guys. As you know, I'm committed to bringing you a blend between technical and fundamental analysis on some of our favorite coins. Today, we're going to do a quick technical updates on Ada, Coty, and Algorand. So if you like that, please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe, and we'll get straight into the charts. So you can see here with Cardano, on the hourly time frame, we were in this wedge, and we were hoping that we could break to the, to, uh, the upside. Now, as we know, with these descending patterns, the likelihood is the majority of the time you will break to the downside. And when you're breaking to the downside, your technical target is at the bottom of the wedge, which for us here on Cardano sits at $1.87, okay? So we can see some downside risk here on Cardano, taking us to a dollar and, uh, what, what do we say there? Dollar and 80, uh, 80 odd cents, a dollar 83, dollar 88, uh, that kind of a range here where this green support line is, okay? So we'll be watching for that out on Coty because this could potentially be a buy the dip opportunity. I've said this many times here on the channel. For me, Coty is a super under, uh, Cardano and therefore Coty, which we're going to come on to shortly, are undervalued plays right now, particularly Cardano, which has run to an all-time high already of over $3. You're seeing a 33% discount on Cardano right now when other, you know, layer one solutions such as Ethereum has just broken an all-time high. Bitcoin created a new all-time high shortly. Cardano is fast asleep right now. So I'd be looking to top up on some of my Cardano at these price points. Anything below $2 for me is an amazing steal for Cardano. But again, not financial advice. Uh, invest smartly for yourselves, right? So the next thing I want to point to is if we just take a look at Coty. And what we can see on Coty is we try to break out of this yellow pattern we can see here on the screen. Now, as we broke out, we ended up in this bull flag pattern. And now normally for a bull flag, the probability suggests you'll break to the upside and carry on your pattern. Now, unfortunately for us here on Coty, that wasn't the case. We've managed to uh, start breaking down to the downside, which is what you can see. Now, the reason I'm less concerned is if I zoom out on this one, you will see that all we're doing is we can come back out to retest the top of the wedge. So it could just be that we're coming down, collecting support from the wedge, and then heading higher. But again, this is gonna this is gonna rely on Cardano showing strength. Like I said, since the Jed partnership, uh, Coty being the official issuer of the Jed token, which is gonna control the gas fees on the Cardano network, which is huge, these two are super tied together, okay? So any weakness in ADA will naturally follow through to Coty, okay? So very important that you understand that these two projects are tied together. Now, zooming back out to the daily, on Coty, we know where we stand in terms of the daily. If I just move me across there, let's get us nice and zoomed out. And we can see that we were forming this beautiful cup and handle pattern on Coty. And uh, that continues to play out quite nicely here on Coty. And um, if we can get a test of this wedge on the yellow wedge where I showed you and a bounce off, we could be heading back higher to test our 66 cents uh, all time high. This is the key for Coty right now. It's really got to go back to 66 cents with vengeance and break through. And when it does, I think this can really get moving. The top of our cup and handle pattern still sits at 80 cents. And we know our longer term price targets for Coty are far beyond that $2 plus. So really exciting for Coty. Now, before I move on to Algorand, guys, if you haven't signed up for your free money, yeah, free money, links are in the description for Swissborg, who are offering up to 100 euros, guys, 100 euros if you just deposit 50 euros, euros in fiat or crypto, okay? And you can just withdraw that afterwards once you've got your reward. Uh, similarly for Coinbase, Coinbase will give you $10 in free Bitcoin when you buy or sell $100 or more in crypto, and BlockFi will give you $10 when you deposit about, I think it was uh, $100 of Bitcoin. Bitcoin. Check the links in the description. Get set up on your different exchanges. You can never have too many exchanges ready to go. Okay, guys, so do go check those out. Right, let's look at Algorand because we want to see what pattern Algorand is uh, creating. So there we go, Algorand chart. And what we can see here on Algorand is if I just move me across, very important pattern forming here on Algorand. You can see we're in this massive triangle pattern. Uh, and we wanted to break out of this triangle pattern here, okay? So we got the breakout, we came back down, got a retest, and we're trying to bounce back off. So on the daily chart, it looks really strong here for Algorand. Now, if I move us across to an hourly chart, 
What we want to see here on Algorand is the following. So you can see here on Algorand, what we've got here is we've managed to, we were in this channel, okay? We were in this channel here and we were trying to break to the upside. We actually broke to the downside, which is inconvenient for us here. But that's not the that's not the bad thing here in this situation because we've still got room to come back down and test the purple wedge, okay? So we've got room to come back down, test that purple wedge where this purple line is here, and we can bounce back off following my white scribble, which I drew a while ago because I had a feeling when we'd get the breakout, we'd curl back around and get the retest up. And that's exactly what we've had there. We've broken out, we've kind of bended round, we've got a bit of a bounce, and now we need to get the momentum to head higher. So on the longer term timeframes, what are we looking at uh, for uh, Algorand as a reminder? Well, what we can see is if we uh, zoom out, you can see here on Algorand, we're forming this wedge and my price target still remains on Algorand of $2.76, okay? $2.76 if we can continue to get a strong breakout on uh, on Algorand from its continuation triangle, okay? So that's really important for Algorand. Uh, Cardano, break into the downside, so I'd be a bit cautious. I'd be looking to buy the dip anywhere under $2 for me. I'd want to stock up. Even though I was buying Cardano at super low prices, um, this, is for, this for me is a very long-term hold for Cardano. I love the project. Uh, do your own research on Cardano, build your own conviction because these kind of stock, these kind of coins can easily fall quite a bit more. But for me, sitting at anything less than two dollars on Cardano, when you've had all-time high sitting at three dollars, and you know the likes of Ethereum have just created all-time high, Bitcoin's created a new all-time high, uh, layer one coins like Phantom, Terra, which is Luna, uh, you know, doing amazingly. Uh, we'd expect Cardano to, come well, on, Cardano does just look undervalued right now. So there you have it, guys. There's an update on those three important coins. If you like my blend between technical and fundamental analysis, then as always, please smash that like button and subscribe. I'm here trying to bring you videos on a Saturday, not in my studio, just here on the iPad, trying to give you an update. So if you appreciate that, please smash up the like button. I'll leave the pinned comment as the link to our free public Discord server. That community is growing rapidly, guys. This, the, this community as a whole is growing rapidly we've gained over 1400 subscribers in just about 28 days so we're really uh, building this community building it for sustainability for good to help you guys invest in a sustainable and pragmatic way guys we're not here to pump some coins and help you get rich really quickly we want you to build wealth in the right way we don't want to scare people away from crypto we want to inst instead take those people who have been burned by a coinbase or a shiba uh a shiba sorry or a doge or something like that and really bring this bring them to the community and show them how to build a real portfolio of Bitcoin, Cardano, Solana, Ethereum, and really build wealth over the longer term. So if you appreciate that, smash the like button, subscribe, join us on this journey, and head into that Discord chat because there's so many like-minded people in there. It's growing really fast, and they're all sharing amazing ideas, talking about new coins, sharing their favorite tokens and what entry prices they're entering in at, sharing chart patterns and what they're seeing. It's really exciting there. And I jump into those chats answering questions all the time as well. So check that out. Definitely don't miss that out. Go collect your free uh, tokens from Swissball, Coinbase and BlockFi. Free money, take it. Uh, and we'll see you in the next one.